Sunshine and warmer temperatures are on the horizon, which means you may be getting the itch to get out on the rivers or bike the trails. Pedal Paddle Play is an annual event that encourages you to do just that, but we'll be seeing some modifications this year. Joining us is Kyle Kwan, Environmental Coordinator with the Northeastern Indiana Regional Coordinating Council. Good morning, Kyle. How are you? Good morning. I'm doing great. So Paddle Paddle Play is usually the day that everybody gets together and goes out on the rivers or heads to the trails. It's going to be different this year. It is. So um, with everything that's going on, um, the event planning committee kind of put our heads together and thought about what we can do to still allow people to get out and explore the trails because um, they're there. We have over 500 miles of water trails and um, in Fort Wayne alone we have over 100 miles of land trails so we still want people to get out there and explore it and this is our annual fundraiser also it's the only way we get any funding to do what we do so um, we want to keep this thing rolling. Um, so we're, we launched a virtual event this year. So the event's virtual, but what immediately comes to my, my mind is, if you're out on the river, you can be socially distant already. So why do it this way? Is it just an extra precaution with everything that's going on? Well, our, our typical event, everyone's coming to one location. Um, we have over 200 people that come there uh, last year to Gilbert Park. So Gilbert Park's not huge. Everybody's right there together. And then if you saw what it was like when we said, all right, let's go everybody's scrambling to get down there to the water. So it, there was no social distancing happening. Uh, so in order to be safer this year, um, to allow for social distancing, people can go out with their family, um, those people that they've already been with all this time, and get out on the rivers or land trails, or go out with friends if you're driving separately and you're putting in your boat separately. You're right, you can social distance very easily that way. And Pedal Paddle Play, like we've mentioned, is a one-day event. So will this be spread throughout a few weeks, maybe months? How does that work? We actually just launched it last week. So um, we've already got some people that are signed up and ready to roll with this. Um, yeah, it's from now through the uh, midnight, July 15th. And um, you can get out on the water or the land trails. And just take a picture of you with our logo somewhere in view. You can draw it. You can wear it. You can print it off. Um, actually, when you register, um, our logo will come up. So you can just print it off at home and take it with you. So you take a selfie or um, take it with a friend and um, post to your Instagram or uh, Facebook with hashtag Pedal Paddle Play 2020. And mention the water trail that you're on or the land trail that you're on. And that gets you, um, after you've registered, that gets you entered into the prize drawing up to six times. So you can do it six times. You have to six tickets. Um, and then we're going to do the prize drawing via Facebook Live also um, on July 18th. So we have all the same awesome prizes we do every year, including the coveted kayak package donated by Fort Wayne Outfitters. So why would you encourage people to give this a try especially during this time? Is this an activity that would be, you know, people, they're trying to find things to do. This is something that, that they can continue to do. Exactly. So this is, um, we're not requiring people to come down to Fort Wayne. You can do it from anywhere in the Tame County, Northeast Indiana region. Like I mentioned, there's 566 miles over 88 access, or over 87 access sites um, that you can get to the river and tons of land trails. So um, it's allowing people to get out and explore other areas um, rather than us pulling them down to Fort Wayne. We're all looking for a way to get out of the house. We've been cooped up. The weather's starting to get nicer. Um, I've already been out on the water several times, um, not in the last couple days because of the rain, but um, I have plans to go out this weekend um, to the reservoir because you don't have to worry about water levels there. So yeah, you're already going out and having fun. Why not post it up with hashtag Pell Pell Play 2020 and uh, earn your chance at some awesome prizes. And then just one last quick question. How much is it to register and where do people need to go? Sure. It's $20 for an individual or $35 for a pair. Um, and like I said, each uh, registration you can get up to six tickets to get into that prize drawing. And all the information is on our website, um, www.neiwatertrails.com. 
All right, Kyle, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Be sure to get out on those trails or the waterways if you want to help this cause. We'll be sure to put all this information on our website, wayne.com, later today.